This is the Rope Masters Video Cast, your source for the best in rope skipping instruction. Hosted by world champion Peter Nessler. This episode, we are back in Cary, North Carolina. We've got Gary Anderson with us. He's the coach of the Super Skippers. He's been jumping for a while. He's going to be breaking down a couple different skills for us. For the JV, he's going to be doing a, it's a single rope skill where he's doing an EB into a, kind of a wrap into a Kruger, then out to a cross. And he'll kind of explain that. It's hard to really describe, but once you see it, you'll figure it out. And then for the varsity, he's doing an EB um, into an EB where he'll be switching from one side to the other. And then he'll be doing it with a 180. So it's a triple under trick. Kind of cool looking to do and he'll break that down so you can see how that works. JV skill. For today's JV skill we'll be doing the EB rope catch to Kruger cross. Now it's important before you do this is to be able to do a Kruger cross so if you cannot do that, that would be a trick you would need to learn first. The important part of this trick is going to be the catch on the EB. If you do that correctly, everything else kind of works itself out. The EB rope catch is going to be a fake EB, so I'm going to be EBing on my left side, and I need to bring it over my head and open up my arm before I catch with my foot. And you'll be tempted initially to not open up, to stay in your EB and try to catch it like that, but you really do need to open up your arm so you can catch here. Now once I've caught it with my foot, I'm going to take the arm that's out to the side, the arm that came out of my EB, and I'm going to bring it behind myself, around my body, and lift, not the leg that's on the, the leg on the same arm that I'm lifting right here, and go straight to my Kruger as I pull this arm out the back. So let me show that one more time. Again, I'm going to do the EB. I'm going to open up and catch. One more time. Open up and catch. The arm that's outstretched comes around my body, and I lift the same side leg to do the Kruger, as I bring my arm out from behind my back. And now I'm in a Kruger, and from here, I can just go to the Kruger cross. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like in motion. Here, catch, Kruger cross. One more time. And again, with the catch, it's important to get it just right so that everything else can work just like that. Now the first time I did it, you notice I caught myself. As I caught it here, as I bring my arm around my body, I don't want to go around my body too much. I want to definitely try to get the rope already moving in an up-down motion. So when I get to my Kruger, the rope isn't trying to travel around my body. So I'm going to try that one more time, show you exactly what it looks like. And that's the EB rope catch Kruger cross. The varsity skill. For the varsity skill, we'll be doing an EB to EB triple with a 180. And I'm going to show it to you on the ground first just so you can get an idea of what it looks like. It's going to be a forwards EB followed immediately by a backwards EB. It looks like this on single bounce. Come around, but I'm going to do that in the air. The big trick here is to make sure you actually get a full turn. A lot of people tend to do their first EB and don't turn all the way for their second EB. You need to be completely turned around for it. Another thing people like to do is if your first EB is not nice and tight to your body, if you go around your body more, like when you're first learning EBs, when you're doing the triple, then you're going to have trouble getting to that backwards EB. Once you get to the backwards EB, you're going to want to just pull your arm out the side because you'll have already jumped. You're just going to pull out the side and just end with a full turn. So it's going to look like this when you do the whole thing. <laughs> come out just like that. You'll notice there's a slight pause after I do my first DB. I jump, do my first DB. I got to wait until I've turned, hit my second. When I land, I make sure to pause for just a moment to get the rope moving around so I can go again. So let me show that one more time. Come around just like that and get that. And you have the uh, EB to EB triple with a 180. For more information, check out www.jumprm.com.